Hello everybody, and welcome back to The Amazing Spider-Man 2. This is a Spence Plays, which means I am by myself here, no Nate around. And today we are going to be continuing our series with part 4. Now, you might have seen my Spidey Sense going off the hook. That's because I'm being chased by Task Force people. Um, if you don't remember last time, I was trying to be a good person, and then they started this task force thing, and they think I'm a bad guy. So, we have to go stop some criminals, so they go, oh wait, Spider-Man's not evil. Should be a given, but apparently it's not. And this is terrifying. Um, how's everyone doing today? I hope you're doing well. Again, sorry it's been a while. But we are getting back into the sewing of things. Ha. 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 I'm gonna stop. Okay. I can't remember how to play because it's been so long. That's okay. We have a disturbing the peace call. Stand by for location. Oh, disturbing the peace. Don't worry, I got him. I got him. That's what it was. It was why to dodge. Not B. I'm playing on the Xbox 360 version of this game, in case you were wondering. This is why they call me amazing. And we're gonna be talking some Marvel, I guess. I don't know. We'll see. Boom. Taken down. I was really scared that someone might see me fighting you losers. Ha! <laughs> Spider Man. He's pretty chill. Spider-Man showed once again that no crime is too small to escape his notice. Great, I'm so glad. I remember now. I remember this news report comes on every single time I do anything. I wonder what Jonah Jameson complained about before I came along. Traffic? Good point, yeah. Ha! This one you think it can't get any better! Yeah, I think it can get a little better. Namely because they're hunting us down unless we save people or stop crimes or do anything. So, we're going to go to this fire by the looks of things on our map. And, yeah, we're just going to have a good time. That'll wake you up. I don't know if I've said this, but it's part four of our Amazing Spider-Man 2 series. I hope you guys have been enjoying it up to this point. Sure but now things are really going to heat up because we're going to a fire. Okay, that'll be my last pun for this episode. I promise. I will try my hardest not to just start shooting puns off a while. You. Um. Wow. This is so so weird being back, guys. Someone, please help me. They look real, really worried. Wow. Speaking is not my thing today. We're just gonna make this episode even better. Oh, flip. Whoa. Oh, I can't see. Oh, gosh. Ah! This is terrifying. Wow, that's a little sad. I'm sorry there's not many heroic people in your life. But Spider Man's here to save the day. He's awesome. Um, here's a little fun fact trivia for you. Uh, Spider-Man is my favorite Marvel hero. Just so you guys know, I really love him. So, this game so far has been pretty good. Um, I was reading some reviews about it, and people have not really liked it that much. Um, I can kind of see where they're coming from, but for the most part, I kind of like it. it. It's fun. You know? Maybe not the ultimate Spider-Man experience, especially with this weird mode, but you know. Definitely a fun game by me, so if you're interested in picking it up, I'd give it a shot, maybe rent it. Firefighters say that without Spider-Man's help, there would almost certainly have been fatalities in the blades. Almost certainly. That, okay. we have reports of fighting possibly gang-related in Central Park. That doesn't sound good. Can you check it out? I will. Central Park, southwest corner? I bet I can get there quicker than the cops. 
really Spidey? Because they're the cops. As the spider swings. That's okay. Yeah, that's where I'm going. Thank you, game, for pulling up my map. So there's gonna be a new Spider-Man movie coming out this year, Spider-Man Homecoming. Let me know down below what you guys think about it, because I'm really excited for it. The trailer looks really funny. Yeah. So what else is new? Why are you doubting me? Are these the people we want to trust with this kind of power? Yeah. Are they? These guys seem like bad biscuits. And you know what they say about bad biscuits. They make the baby broke. Oh, I know what's bothering you. You think because I took down Herman Schultz, it means I like him more. That's just not true. You'll get the same up close and personal attention. I promise. There's that clip. So in the last few episodes, I was talking about how different this seems from the actual movie it's supposedly based on. Yeah, I, I watched it again recently. Much, much different. Hey, wrapping up bad guys is my thing. I do mean I can help. I can help you. I bet you can, random man. Craven the Hunter. You got my attention. All right. So, oh my, wow! At the bus station, holy, whoa! We gotta get there, man. All units, officers are under fire at the bus station. There's only one bus station in all of New York <laughs> because they're just calling it the bus station. Like there's only the one. Seems a bit strange. That's all I'm saying. If you if you live in New York or you know more about New York uh, New York than I do, let me know if there's only the one uh, bus station. They say there. bad guys don't think of themselves as bad guys, but come on, you must know. How did these guys get these weapons? These are insane, like military grade machine guns they're using. Seems a bit weird that they're robbing the bus station. I think that's what they're doing. Maybe. You're okay in my book. Thank you, Officer Rando. I'm not Rambo. Rando. I can Rando man. And who the cuss? He looks angry, and not at all friendly. I'll come right out with some cold water. So I have to seismic attack him from the stuff I stole from Shocker, and not die when he throws me around. Too late, I died. <laughs> so shoot him with the stuff from Shocker, punch him a bunch, back up immediately. And I mean immediately. <laughs> Sounds like a day's work for me as Spider-Man, the really cool guy. We're gonna give that one more go. Because that will be helpful. Perhaps, maybe not. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe maybe it's impossible. Maybe this is the end of the game. It's just we're beating up some fat dude and no offense to people who just look at him. He's a big old meanie. Fine. Maybe the end of the game is big old meanie in the bus station. With a tutorial on how to use my gadgets. Neither does the seismic blast. Oh it's a dead I'm gonna do this again for your benefit. And we're gonna evade. And shoot him. Alright. This is easy now. Yeah, keep smacking him. Yeah, hey, you we took best. him down, number eight. Take that. Spider-Man! 
Oh, look. Look who like. I'm happy. Impressive. But you are still raw. Did you just call me raw? I was experienced enough to beat your friends. No. Oh, I am Russian. Come back. But I am no friend to those pigs. My name is Sergei Kravenov. Men call me Craven the Hunter. All right, say okay. So you left me that note. Huh. Judging from the web, you're one of those crazy reality show guys who runs around naked in the woods eating bugs. How can you help me? I can make you a true hunter. Not just a boy pretending to be a man. Thanks. Should you wish to accept, you may find me here. All right, business card Until we meet again. He seems like a friendly man. Carter, he doesn't. Why didn't you get me pictures from the Fisk Osborne press conference? Oh, sorry, Mr. Jameson, but I've got school. You know, life outside the job. In my day, your job was your life. A press pass is wasted on you. Oh. <laughs> Thanks a lot. I hope the bad guys appreciate all the effort. I actually, I just got an idea for using my press pass. Got to admit, it would be nice not to feel like I'm fighting this battle on my own. But is Craven someone I can trust? Craven obviously doesn't know who I really am, or he would have come to my house. Good point. Good I don't know. Point. I've always worked best alone. But then again, I've never tried it any other way. Not Spider-Man, buddy. Craven can teach me his hunting Wait, techniques. Wait, you are Spider-Man, not Batman. I have to rely on police broadcasts to find bad guys. It's not like I tell Craven my real name. And I'll be on guard. <sighs> okay? Don't be nervous. You need information on Craven, and you've got a press pass to get it with. <laughs> Easy peasy. Never mind that if he finds out you're a photographer and not a reporter, he'll have you stuffed and mounted. <laughs> I don't think that he'd do that, but you know. Enter the loft. Sure, why not? Why? That's not suspicious. <laughs> Spider Man just left, and this dude walked up to the same place he was just standing. I'm just saying, a little bit more stealth would have been lovely there, Spidey, but who am I to judge? I'm not. I'm not one to judge. Uh, Mr. Cravenoff? It's me, Peter Parker, from the Daily Bugle? Um, he lives you in a nightmare home. We did. The, the door w Mr. Cravenoff? Oh, man, is this gonna be one of those inner for you things again? Remember those? They're, they're great, aren't they? Well, he has some cool stuff, though, I'll give him that. But he lives in a flippin' haunted house with the lights off. And the lightning outside is not helping his cause. <laughs> oh, I apologize for startling you. I am Craven. Oh, hey, man. Please, forgive my theatrics. <laughs> I merely wish to demonstrate my skills. I didn't The see. videos online do that pretty well. I saw you take down that Siberian tiger with your bare hands, without hurting it. Tigers are endangered. I simply relocated the beast for its own safety, as well as that of the local villagers. True hunters wish to conserve the natural world. It is where we find peace. Hmm. You're a long way from the natural world. Yeah, a little bit. I craved a new challenge. I came here to hunt the monsters Oscorp created. The cross species. The deadliest combination of animal and human. I ended their threat. But I grew fond of your city. And your city grew fond of me. I don't think the city and has feelings. I decided to stay. Except now you're hunting normal people. No. Only criminals. Boom. Only Good guy. those who prey <laughs> their fellow man have anything to fear from me. There you go. He seems pretty great. Oh, well, we got a little... Just, uh, what about the task force? Tell me about them, bro. This new task force is sending a pretty strong message. No vigilantes. Uh, I do not trust them. 
They are paid for by Fisk. Is that a problem? I am sure you've heard the rumors of his illegal activities. Sure, everyone has. But no one can prove it. And the police seem okay with him. Well, okay Because then. he has paid those who are corrupt. The rest are desperate to avoid looking incompetent. Well, the public is desperate for an end to the crime wave. I oh have my gosh, it's like Chaisa tells me. To get results. I'm glad he's getting results, though. How do police feel about it? Based you? on my experience, uh, research, the police aren't big fans of vigilantes. The police had their chance to stop the crime wave. They failed miserably. <laughs> I, uh, failed. I don't think they like being reminded of that. I do not wish to insult them. Oh, you just did. It would be a far greater crime to have the power to help, but to refuse to act. Would you not agree? I would, in fact, agree. Yeah. As a matter of fact, I would. All right. Maybe this not villain man is okay. Is man really the most dangerous game? In their own way, yes. But men are merely highly evolved animals. Mm -hmm. The current crime wave provides fascinating opportunities to study them. This is kind of Patterns of the various factions. And what are you finding out? That criminals are not unlike beasts. They have hunting grounds, specific behaviors. Many travel in packs, but there are differences. Such as? Animals prey on others for survival. Only human beings are willfully cruel. Whoa. Hmm. Didn't think of about that way, did you, Pete? All right, let's finish this conversation. So you're saying you feel a responsibility to use your power to help? Yes. To have such power and not use it is to be unworthy of it. Great well, power, thanks. great responsibility. I think our readers will find this very interesting. Good, good. I must take this call. It but does please a call. look around. Take pictures of anything you wish. Oh, thanks, man. Yes. No, I said tranquilizer darts. No, I have no interest in automatic weapons. They require no skill. I am an artist. <laughs> He's an artist of the hunt. And for that, I can somewhat respect. All right, let's take some pictures. How do I... How do I take pictures? Oh, whoa, 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 I got messages. Okay. Barker, I need a shot of the Oscorp sign. Yeah, okay. Arkery, you have friends at Oscorp. Give me an advance look at the new flight harness they're making for the military. Okay. Arkery, if you get inside Oscorp, I want to shove the robotic limbs they made for handling hazardous materials. Got it, see? I want that on my desk by noon. I want Spider-Man's map. Blah, blah, blah. Watch out for the task force, Pete. I ain't waiting. Spider-Man, I thought I should warn you. Task force is being innovative press the crime wave initiative oh my gosh oh, way off and they're specifically targeting you i'm not sure why blah blah blah, blah, blah. great okay that would make a good photo i'm glad you think so mate why don't i call me how do i how do i how do i how do i, how do I? How do I? How do I? All right. Pressing every button I have. The right stick. The right stick is... Okay. We'll take some pictures and then we'll be done with this episode. That would make a good photo. I love how the game specifically tells you what would and would not make a good photo. Oh, oh, I just, I want to move. We already have a snake picture. How would the globe make a good photo? You know what, forget it. The game wants it, the game will get it. Okay, zoom. 
Zoom in. Zoom. Oh, I need to step back. Am I too close? Want me to? Want me to move up or down? Nope. I need to move back farther. I can always zoom. Boom. No. Flip. Boom. Good shot. Good shot. Yeah. Pardon the interruption. It's your Would house, you dude. care to see my latest trophies? Fine. We'll look at Craven's latest trophies, and then we'll end the episode. Since he's so insistent. Oh, I should have taken a picture of the fro rug, dude. That looks awesome. All oh, right, that's not awesome. Animal cruelty is bad. Well, it's probably a fake, considering uh, Craven here. Oh my gosh, freaky stuff. Cross species, <laughs> beautiful, are they not? Um. I thought Spider-Man captured them. An inadequate solution. They escaped. They did. So you killed them? To save the lives of their victims, yes. But also in self-defense. They were deadly opponents. Oh, yeah. No, I mean, I can imagine. More conversation. Do you kill your prey? This episode's not gonna end for a uh, while, by the looks of things. Sorry if it goes a little what longer. Do you consider everyone. it okay to kill when there is no other choice? I do not take life lightly, but when it is necessary, I do not hesitate. All right. If my failure to act cost the life of an innocent person, I could not live with myself. I know what you mean. Do you have powers? They all had superhuman powers. How'd you beat them? I have trained myself to the peak of human ability. All right. And learned many natural means of enhancement. Great, drugs, like drugs. Like the scum who pollute the Not streets. Not drugs. <laughs> but the secrets of native cultures. Herbs, potions, mysteries forgotten by so-called civilized man ah uh, you can't get those mysteries that help you get strong hunting criminals some people might wonder if you're the carnage killer oh uh, he is no hunter but a brute a savage his very existence is offensive to men like myself well, so you even though he's hunting him. criminals you'd like to take him down of course he dishonors what I do. Without honor, Peter, the hunt means nothing. Boom. It's all about that honor, Last everyone. Last question. Is there anything you haven't accomplished yet? I want to kill Spider-Man. Uh, <laughs> yes. I would like to leave a legacy when I am gone. Pass my training to a protege. Oh, okay. My only family is a brother who... Well, he chose a different path. He's an accountant. I never had a son, but perhaps, uh, forgive me, I am becoming melancholy as I get older. That's why I want so, to transpire. do you have what you need, Mr. Parker? I had what yeah. I need before. I think I do. Yeah, man. Yeah, I think I do. Perhaps a picture of him would be great. There, that is a prize. All right, thank you, man. Where's the exit? All right. Well, this has been a lot of fun. Thank you all for tuning in to part four of our amazing Spider-Man 2 journey. I hope you all had a fantastic time today. I do not mean that in a sarcastic way at all. I hope you had a lot of fun. Tune in next time when we... Entered the lion's den, apparently. That sounds fantastically scary. Let's see the cutscene. No cutscene, just I exploded green. Awesome. What an Whitney. ending. Okay. Whitney, should I be jealous? Who is this? That's no way to talk to a lady. Or even me. You know, lady. Uh, Felicia, this is the number I gave Whitney Chang. How'd you get it? 
my hands on things I'm not supposed to. As in How this. You, Spider? Do you ever get your hands on things you're not supposed to? I heard you were back in jail. Listen, if you're calling to tease me about breaking out... Well, his mouth's not so moving, have I can think of a lot more fun things to tease you about. Ah. If you're smart, you'll get out of town before I find the time to chase you. Funny. That's what I was going to say to you. Things are getting dangerous around here, Spider. No, oh, whoa, Why I'm supposed to Spider-Man? each other out of town, hmm? I'm too busy to fool around with you. I, yeah. I mean, play games with you. Bye, Felicia. Get out of here, Felicia. No one flippin' loves you. That was really harsh. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> See you next time on uh, Spence Plays Amazing Spider-Man. Bye. Have a good one.